after a weekend of violence between Israel and the Palestinian Islamic Jihad, and with a ceasefire now in place, the Palestinian permanent observer addressed an emergency meeting of the UN Security Council. As the highest authority responsible for the maintenance of international peace and security, how many more children do we have to bury until someone says enough is enough? Israel, also present, placed Thank blame with a Palestinian militant Thank group. The Palestinian Islamic Jihad deliberately fired 1,100 rockets at Israeli civilians with roughly 200 landing inside the Gaza Strip. 46 people were killed in the violence, all of them Palestinian, including 15 children. Misfired Palestinian Jihad rockets were responsible for 14 of the deaths, the rest the result of Israeli airstrikes. Israel says this offensive was preemptive. In an interview with France 24, the Palestinian ambassador to France condemned what she termed a barbaric and murderous attack. Today, we call on the whole world, the whole international community, and actors with excellent relations with Israel, who adopt the Israeli version of events to end Israel's impunity. Israel says future such actions are not off the table. In the future, if it becomes necessary, we will launch a preemptive strike in order to protect the citizens of Israel, its sovereignty and its infrastructure. This is true on every front, from Tehran to Canyonis. The UN Security Council issued no statement as a result of its discussions on what has been the worst flare-up of violence in the region since the 11-day conflict in May last year.